Hello again, it's Armor Chocobo, and uh, new year, new Let's Play. I'm going to be doing something that I held off on because it had star power behind it, but with the new year coming around, I figured, you know what? He ain't the president of it. He's not even the vice chairman of the council that ran the game to begin with. It's going to be a game back from 2005, even though it's made to look a lot older because it was made in honor of the MXX game system from Sony that never got out of Japan. It's only ran by three people called the GR3 Project, Samiru, Duplex, and Naramura. They now got a bunch more people and now they're Nigoro Corporation. They recently released, re-released this game in Japan. And it's doing quite well, but Nintendo, for some reason or another, let me adjust the screen, um, is giving them localization problems, so I figured now's the best time to play it, because it's not going to go to the Americas for a while, it seems. This is the intro to the game. Just like Cave Story, this game likes to withhold information from us until the very last moment. You ain't going to understand any of this, don't try. But I'm telling you, this is a very good game, and you should try playing it. And finally, the title screen! Let's play La Milana! Made by GR3 Corporation in 2005. Not much to the title screen, let's just get started. You could hear better music later. Like this great music! Accompanied by Indiana Jones looking green guy. Named La Meza. <laughs> this is the surface area. This is where we all start out. It's kind of like, uh, you know, where the ship is in Metroid. Everything you're going to be doing save-wise is going to happen right here. This is the surface. This is the base area. And that's a pot. I'm going to smash it. Like a good archaeologist. That's right. La Meza is an archaeologist. And his family line descends from ninjas. Don't try to make sense of that. Anyway, he received a letter from his father. There's treasure inside the ruins of La Milana. His dad already went in ahead and never came out again. Now it's time for La Meza. But first, we need to talk to old people. Right in here is Elder Zelbud. Hey, Zelbud. He's a little weird fellow. Sometimes he's very wise, like right now. But later, he kind of loses it. And he's pretty negative. What a jerk. I'm gonna beat La Milana silly. I'm gonna throw the gauntlet at him, I'm gonna pick it up, and I'm gonna bludgeon it to death with the gauntlet. That's right. You better open that ruins. Let's talk to him again, why not? Before you go, take this. Now, there is no free handouts in this game. Expecting Legend of Zelda? I think not, even though the hero is wearing green. Let's talk to him one more time. What? Yes, you keep on talking to him, he slowly starts to lose it and starts rambling on about old MXX game systems. MSX, not XX. What's wrong with me? Anyway, we need cash. I already got a little bit of it already for breaking that pot open. There's about 20 coins, 40 coins on the surface here. It's not very big. And I'm going in the wrong direction already because I want stuff. Like those weights. See those stone cylinders up in the corner? They help me solve puzzles later. These snakes help me... I don't know. They help me by dying, I guess. And dropping one coins. Pots have anywhere from 10 to 100 coins, and then these drop one coin. Sometimes they drop a weight, and they drop other things too, but we can't find them just yet. Okay. The West is dead to me for a moment. We'll just keep going this way. We need to buy something in one of these shops. Check out! Shop! Shopping! We can't afford any of this. Well, I want that. But not right now. <clears throat> That'll be later. Let's go in here. Oh, wow, this is expensive. That's the MSX2. You'll see that later. 
Yes, the laptop Lameza carries around is called the MSX, because... You just have MXX for everything. Like that hand scanner I just bought. It's a peripheral for an MSX. I guess he used it to scan barcodes or something. I don't know. I'm not Japanese. Let's go up here. These birds thinking they're hot stuff by flying. Look at us, we could fly. Yeah. Well, I have a whip. Let's solve a puzzle right away. Yeah! Let's not go in there just yet. That leads us to La Milana in the graveyard of all those Transformers episodes they ever made. Every single one of them got cancelled. Except for those Michael Bay movies. Well, they're actually pretty good. Can't rant on Michael Bay. Alright. Third time's a charm. Yeah! Just like in Castlevania, Lameza has physics issues whenever he's hit. And I'm getting weights by the tons. Kill everything in this room, we get a prize in that chest. And you'll get hit with a yam. I think that's a yam. What is that? Well, I keep on falling. That is the conch shell, the shell horn, whatever. It plays a note whenever you do something good. And when you do something bad. It's not judgmental. And let's get some more coins, why not? By jumping over birds. I'm getting hit by birds. Okay, I could have sworn there was a coin in that pod. What about this pod? You're not jumping in the water yet. La Meza gets really hurt by water. I don't know why. But we need an item to keep ourselves from drowning. Ah, I'm getting my butt beat already. This is a very big game. This is actually a very difficult game. We've only seen maybe... what? 0.2% of the game right now. I'll keep you updated on how far we are into a game. Right now, 0.2%. How about we go into La Milana? Why not? This place is dead to me. Oh, I could have bought that ROM out there. Oh well. Let's equip our handy scanner and start reading stuff. Like this tablet. Surely it's in English. No. Tough luck. It's written in some weird La Milani's Moon language. We need a, ra a ROM for that. You slap on the ROMs right here. I don't have any. We could also read skeletons. They leave notes. They also have other things. Like over here. Uh, by the way, if anybody loves bats, you're gonna love this game. This game loves its bats. Sure, there's only two bats now. Soon they'll be in a the million. So there's a ROM on a skeleton. Athletic land. Can't do anything with it. Half the... well, not even half. More like 95% of these ROMs don't do a thing. There's only a few useful ROM combinations, but we need NMXX2 for that. How about we get more life? A life crystal! Gotten by hitting a switch. Okay, there's absolutely nothing else in this room. We'll be back here. We'll be back here a lot. This is the guidance gate. It's pretty much the tutorial dungeon of the entire area. Shows you how, what to do here. Oh, that looks fancy. Let's try reading this. Nope. No dice. Still need a reader. Glyph reader. Usually there's stuff in these... Smash every pot every time you load, because the pots refill. Most of them, anyway. Here. I'm going to be coming back here a lot, because there's two weights right here. We got more tablets that we can't read just yet. We got skeletons we can murder with whips. I'm gonna start solving puzzles like nobody's business. And whipping bats. These bats are going to be my bane. Hey, let's jump down here. Nope. Trap. Don't jump down into traps, people. It's not good for you. Alright, 
Who wants to be hit by lightning? I do! Do not strike puzzle solutions. Yeah, how the heck am I gonna get that pedestal? There's spikes down there. I don't like spikes. I've got plenty of spikes in Cave Story. Stop it with the spikes. Just don't whip interesting blocks like those or you'll get God Lightning. Nah, heck with it. Jump into the spikes! They're fake. Psych! <laughs> Alright, a Shurgan. First sub-weapon in the game. It's actually kind of your staple. And just hinting again at Lemez's little ninja heritage going on here. It's arguably one of the best sub-weapons in the game. I kind of like uh, the pistol myself, but it's expensive as hell. Okay, I want to get up there. These pots contain things now, and kangaroo rats have a vendetta. There. You can whip on ladders, and your whip, like, hits above you before it hits forward. Shurikens are now in the pots. Because we discovered shurikens. Can't do anything else here. Let's head down more. Deeper into the ruins. First level of the ruins. We got these dudes. I have no idea what they are. They look like grub people. Don't hit that. God lightning. And don't do this. Never ever do this. Because you'll get jawed. That's a, pu that's a trap sound right there. Now you heard every sound that could be made with the conch horn. Shell horn. Why do I keep on calling it a conch shell? Hey buddy. How you doing? Hey, he's surprised that I could jump this high. Yeah. That's a map. I'm not going to be using maps. I'm going to be using a wiki like a normal person. Plus, you need a ROM, so I don't need to deal with it. You know what? i got to agree with people. That dude there on the wall with his mouth open kind of does look like Apocalypse. Okay, can't go there just yet. Get out of my way. We're going down here now. I gotta whip a gem. I have a compulsion. I must whip gems. Out of my way, bats. Okay. Whip it a little better. Don't hit me. There we go. Did something. Stop it! Wow. This is gonna give me some kind of stress disorder. And there's something in that room that I want. Yes, it's a ROM. The spikes won't pop up if you don't fall down. So we can just murder blue kangaroo rats. And get Mahjong Dojo! Is there anything over here? Oh. Yeah, it would be. But, you know, ruins are always filled with monsters. Let's check this guy. Okay, nothing. Whatever. There's supposed to be another skeleton in our room. I don't care now. That leads to another area down there. I don't want to go there just yet. I want to murder everything in this room. Take that, bat. I'm going to have a tool for you later. It's called a knife to the face. Does Lametta get a knife? We're going to have to find out later. And those eyeballs. So you see these eyeballs? Like little blue pixels. They're following me around. Stop that! Creeps me out. Jeez. Let's solve a puzzle. Then I'll head back. In fact, no. I'm gonna leave this puzzle for later. Let's head back now. Yep. It closes off if you go in the other direction. But we can't teleport just yet. Is an ability to? I didn't have to... I didn't earn it yet. We're gonna have to walk around for a while. Hope you like backtracking. Hope you like skeletons. There's plenty of those. Or skeletons than you could possibly want. I'm gonna buy me a rock, and I'm gonna save me a game. I definitely want to get coins put together.
I'm gonna be raiding pots. That's what all archaeologists love to do. You think those pot fragments are there? No, they're usually whole. Then the archaeologist smashes them, takes all the good stuff, then examines the pot. That's good archaeology. Okay, where did that... where is that ROM I needed back? There it is. Give me that Game Master ROM. But let's just save our game with Elder Zelda. Got anything else crazy to tell us first? Okay, actually, that was intelligent. Are you sane again? No, not anymore. What's with you and penguins? Alright, let's save our game. You bet your bippy I do. Yeah, well, I beat the game on that save anyway. Alright. Next time, we delve deeper into the Guidance Gate, we get ourselves a Glyph Reader, and we learn to read. See you later, folks.